A dog's tail. Best of friends. Once a long time ago, cats and dogs were best of friends. They lived together, together in small communities, in perfect harmony. They worked together to get food and had fun playing with each other. They also kept kept each other warm during cold winter nights. When cats and dogs were friends, they helped each other in times of need. One time, a cat at a River bank was trying to catch a fish for lunch. All of a sudden, splash! The cat fell into the water. As soon as the dog sa- cat said meow, a big friendly dog jumped into the river and rescued the cat. Another time, a dog was trying to catch a mouse. No matter. How hard the dog tried, the mouse managed to stay ahead. The dog asked the cat for help. As soon as the dog said "woof woof," a cat came to help. Cats and the dogs made a great team. Spring party. One year, the days started becoming warmer and longer. A cat decided to throw a big party to celebrate the. Arrival of spring. This cat in, invited all of its friends, cats and dogs, to the big celebration. Hundreds of dogs, cats and dogs, gather at the tops of a, a hill under a full moon. The cats and dogs were happy and ready to eat. Dance and enjoy the party. There was food and music, and everyone was in a great mood. I was no no here. Just before the dancing began, a storm cloud storm cloud covered the moon. Then it started to rain. Someone suggested that they move the party to a barn near the hill. Wet, the muddy cats and the dogs soon arrived at the small barn. The dogs thought it would be a good idea to take、uh, off their muddy tails instead of spring, bringing them inside the barn. All the dogs, big and small, left their small left their tails by the door. They left the tails organized by size, so it would be easier for each dog to find its own tail at the end of the party. A bad joke. The dogs were enjoying themselves when a group of mischievous young cats decided to play a joke on them, without thinking about the consequences. The cat decided it would be funny to change the dogs' tails around. They mixed up all the dogs' tails, putting big tail next to small ones. Long hair tail, where short hair tails were, and so 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 on. Each of the tail ended up in a different place from where its owner had left it. Inside the barn, the mood of the guests started to change. The storm seemed to put the cats and the dogs in a bad frame of mind. A few cats started complaining, grumbling, and shooting mean looks at the dog. This made the dog feel uncomfortable, and before long, they began complaining and growling too. The fight. As the tension grew, the cats grouped together, and the dogs did just the same. One group started insulting the other group, and the other group responded with more insults. A bolt of lightning 
crashed through the storming sky. The hare on the cat's back the ropes, and the dog bared with their teeth. When the cat began to show their claws, one tiny scared dog shouted, "Let's get out of here now!" All the dog fled the barn in a hurry. With the angry cats chasing them, as the dog passed by the door, they each grabbed a tail without looking at it and kept on running. The dogs ran as fast as they could until no cats were in sight. When they had caught their breath, the car, the dogs all tried to put on the tail they had grabbed. At that point, they discovered a problem. All the dogs had grabbed the wrong tail. They tried in vain to find their own tail. Unfortunately, some big dogs ended up with a small tail, and some small dog ended up with a huge tail. None of the dogs had their own tail. To this day, the dogs haven't forgotten what happened with the cats. The night for the reason we always see dogs chasing the cats, seeking revenge for the nights their tails were switched.